What is going on guys, if you're new here, my name is Captain Charlie, and today we're taking you through my Gemini Jazz 2021 August airport update for you guys today. I'm super excited to bring in this airport update, I put a lot of hard time in working on this, and I have a ton of new models. So without further ado, we'll just get started. Here we have a UPS Boeing 747-8, departing out to Oshkosh, again, it did not come from O'Hare, really departed from CVG. I actually got a chance to see this airplane in person, which is absolutely amazing. So I'm super excited about that, and he'll be departing out to Oshkosh for a charter flight. Then following him, we have an Alaska Airbus A321 Neo. He's departing out to Seattle Tacoma. Then following behind him, we have a Delta Airbus A220-300. He's departing out to Atlanta, then going out to Fort Lauderdale. Next up here, we have Valeris Airbus A220 Neo. He's departing out to Guadalajara. Then last but not least, we have an American Airbus A219 on the Allegheny livery departing out to Charlotte Douglas. Then, following down the taxiway, we have a Royal Jordanian Boeing 787-8, only wide body in the tarmac today, and he is departing out to Frankfurt. And then, last but not least, we have Spirit Airlines Airbus 821 Neo. He just came in from Minneapolis and departing out to Fort Myers. Now we'll turn into our, our attachment of the cargo section with our Airbridge Cargo 777-200. He just came in from Europe, and we'll make being the turnaround and head back out there. Next, we have a FedEx Express, one triple seven dash two hundred. He's going down to CVG, making a turnaround and heading down somewhere in Florida. Then, last but not least, again he's not cargo, but this is a storage spot for United triple seven dash three hundred. He'll be maintaining a heavy check here, then heading back down to Denver to do more service out there. Next, we'll conduct our T five. This is O'Hare's biggest terminal and serves all wide body and international aircraft. So here, starting off at M1, we have a Frontier Airbus A321-200. Sorry, Airbus A321neo is the correct, correct name. And he will be departing out to Denver. Next, following him, we have Southwest, again, a very new addition to O'Hare. Southwest Airlines, Boeing 737 in the 4 to 1 livery, uh, special edition. And he will be departing down to Baltimore. Then next, we have a Southwest, Boeing 737-700 in the Hart livery. He will be departing down to Memphis. Next up here, we have a Copa Airlines Boeing 737 MAX 9. He just came down to O'Hare to get some service checked, and they'll be departing back out. Next here, our only big Delta wide body. All the other Deltas are in Terminal 2, but this is a Delta Airbus A350, and he's departing out to Frankfurt, and that is actually a rail route, but just not in the specific aircraft. Then we have an Iberia Airbus A321. He is departing out somewhere in Spain. Again, don't have a realistic route for him. But then, our first new change to the airport, we have that upper gate. This is actually realistic with M11A. This is an actual configuration gate at O'Hare and T5. So I I'm happy to include this in here. And serving it right now is an Emirates Airbus A380. And Airbus A380. And he'll be departing out to Dubai in the animal livery. Next to him, we have a KLM Boeing 747-400. He'll be departing out to Amsterdam. Next up here, we have Virgin Atlantic Boeing 787-9. He's departing out to Sydney, Australia. And then last but not least, to conclude our T5, we have our British Airways Boeing 747-400. He's just a beautiful aircraft. Every Sunday night, I always see these airplanes, and they're really magnificent and gorgeous. I wish they would keep them longer, but again, I know the airline had to retire them. And again, do not pay attention to these Hawaiians. They are not really part of the update. I just had to put them somewhere. And again, they're not part of the update. So that's why they're there. Alrighty, that concludes our Terminal 5. And that is the biggest part of the terminal. And now we'll go into Terminal 2. Terminal 2 is very small, by the way. So, anyway, we'll start here with our Delta Boeing 757-300. He's departing out nonstop to Atlanta. Following him, we have a Delta Airbus A321-200. We have, he is departing out to New York LaGuardia. And then lastly, we have a sadly retired Delta MD-90. He will be departing out to Minneapolis again. That may not be realistic. And then lastly, I forgot to mention this aircraft in the taxiway. We have Delta CRJ-700 departing all the way out, all the way out to Atlanta as well. But he'll be making a connection and taking it down in somewhere in Florida. Next up here is a very, very exciting new thing. We have, sorry for the bumps, we have a ground gate United Q200 United Express. This is our only United aircraft in Terminal 2, and he 
will be making that very short turnaround for Lexington, Kentucky. Again, really, that's mostly served on a CRJ 550 or Embraer ERJ-175. But again, I didn't really know where else to send him, so he is going to head down there today. Then we have our JetBlue and the new iHeart New York livery, departing off to New York JFK. Next to him, we have our two Alaska gates. We have an Alaska Boeing 737-900. He's departing out to out to Anchorage, having a stop in Seattle. Next up here, we have an Alaska honoring all those who serve livery. He'll be taking it down to Las, An Las Vegas with a stop with no stops, and he'll be departing down to Las Vegas, Nevada. Again, that may not be realistic. Then kicking it off into our American terminal, we have an American Boeing 787-8. He'll be departing out to London Heathrow. And then another really favorite new aircraft, we have our SkyWest Boeing Bombardier CRJ-700. He will be departing down on the way down to Greensboro, North Carolina. Again, that route may not be realistic. Next up here, we have an American Airbus A320-200. He'll be departing out to Dallas, Fort Worth. Then lastly here, we have an American Boeing 767-300ER. He'll be departing down to Los Angeles, California. And that is the main two terminals. This is the main terminal, Terminal 5, Terminal 2, and 2-3. And then lastly, obviously, the main huge thing you guys are here for is Terminal 1. This is my United Terminal. All these aircraft are United, and I'm super excited to get this going. So we'll just kick it off here with our United CRJ-200. He will be departing out to a short hop to Columbus, Ohio. Next up here, we have a United CRJ-550. Also, we'll be taking it down to Greensboro, North Carolina. Next up here, we have a United Embraer ERJ-175. He'll be taking it down to, to New York LaGuardia. Next up here, we have another United ERJ-175. He'll be taking it down to, to do a short hop to Minneapolis. Then we have an United Airbus A319 departing down to Washington, D.C. Washington, Dallas, sorry. And next we have a United Boeing 737-800. All these are new livery, by the way. And he'll be departing down to Denver. Then lastly, we have our wide body here representing C Concourse. We have a United Boeing 777-300ER, new livery. He'll be departing all the way down to Tokyo, Narita today. And that concludes my Chicago Hair Airport update. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. It was super fun to make and took a lot of hard work. I really hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you're new, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.